I was like, now that I'm 21, I'm ready to live it up. Why is my head at a 45 degree angle? I don't know. I'm living it up. I reached a point in my life now where I could successfully live alone and not die, probably. And honestly, with YouTube, my life has had quite the upgrade from six months ago when I was crying in the bathroom thinking that I was gonna be a failure for the rest of my life, which I could be. Things happen, things change, but for now, Woo! So anyway, I started the process of looking for apartments on Zillow and it's really scary, okay? And I am a sketched out girl. I came to a situation where I have two options and I freaking hate when I do this because that's four, but sorry, I'm kind of an idiot. Two options. One, I could find an apartment on my own, sign a lease. Two, while I'm still kind of figuring things out, I move into the office and just pay them for rent. So I'm, listen to me. Please don't come after me. Just trying to survive. <laughs> but anyway, back to the story. So from what I've heard from Garrett and Andrew and Shane, who have spent a lot of time here, um, it's kind of full of demons. Living in the upstairs of the office. <laughs> Isn't that place haunted? <laughs> No. It's not haunted, it's just like evil. I wanted to spend the night here and realistically see how horrifying it is. How does this work? What was that? That's gotta go. If I'm sleeping and that's what's going off, I will scream so loud there will be an earthquake. You guys will feel it and be like, yep. <laughs> sure. So I packed up a small bag. I said my goodbyes to Uno and Honey and Shane and Ryan, who I all know will miss me dearly. And honestly, I'm here to offer my support. Like I can come back. These dogs are ruining your Wait, bed. Right now for protection, I'm scared. Look, he doesn't, they don't want me to leave. How sad is that? <laughs> Shove this in. I can do it. Um, mm, uh. Garrick, <laughs> and my cup. Oh my god. I said I wasn't useful. Tell me when the step is. Is there a step? Yeah, right there. Right there? Oh god. Oh god. What's happening? I would look at you, but I can't move my head or everything's gonna fall. <laughs> Leaving. Oh, okay. She's gonna stay in your haunted office. <gasps> Wait, really? Well, yeah. Wait, is anyone even gonna miss me? Well, well, yeah. couch. <laughs> I was there the other night trying to edit, and um, yeah, it's really fucked up. Wait, why? Well, the top room. It, wouldn't that be my bedroom if I moved there? Yes. <laughs> um, the top room is um. The worst, so the lights always go on and off and flicker in a weird way. This place is scary. Even though the electrical's fine, um, it gets really cold up there. <laughs> it's so cold. There's a lot of weird noises, and then when you walk away from the room and go downstairs, it'll sound like there's somebody still up there walking around. Wait, Shane, why are you telling her this if we want her to move out into that apartment? She loves ghosts. I don't know what she thinks about demons, but... Demons? That has to be what it is. I don't know, maybe I'll come visit you a little later because I, you know me, I like don't really- Sorry, I have plans for the night. Yeah, she has a date with a demon. <laughs> this is gonna be sad when you actually move out. You didn't miss me. Bye. Oh wow, this is really not good for my confidence. Ow. Wait, you're ruining your blanket. Oh my God, your blanket's dragging no, everywhere. Ah! Wait, oh that's disgusting. Oh no. Oh my gosh. You could wash it. Oh my god. Wash? <gasps> it's all, oh my god. Ah! Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Whoa, no. It's all, oh my god. That is tragic and a half. What the <laughs> heck is going on? <laughs> it doesn't want me to leave. <laughs> Not the Starbucks cup. My Starbucks cup is double broken. And my blanket sucks. <laughs> oh, what a great send off. So I guess I'll drop you off for now and then you can, um, I guess like, I don't know. Oh, let me get my cure. 
Eric. I'm scared. And you know what? We took our little ship and we sailed over to the office. Oh, but we got snacks first, of course. So Rylan took me to the store like he was my dad, but you know. You know what? You shouldn't call your brother your dad because that's weird on so many levels. Sometimes you just need like some daddy support in <laughs> okay. Should I get wine in case I get scared? Now that I'm 21, I can yes. drink myself oh. to sleep. Oh my gosh, yeah. This would be oh, this one has a llama on it. Well, since you like the llama so much, you might as well. Do I look like- Ew. I love snack peas. Ooh. We're not gonna be together, so you have to get your own snack. Right. I Chips and salsa, I'm gonna have a party. 2.69, ooh. Okay, what a bargain. These, if you don't know, are the best snack of all time. And he is struggling. <laughs> what am I gonna eat for dinner? Oh, you should cook. Cook? This is amazing lighting. The spinach ricotta organic pizza high. It's incredible. High Trader Joe's. Well, it's all pizza. Okay. Is there an oven? I'm it's a woman and strong. <laughs> and I also lost my credit card, so mom, if you're watching this, I'll pay you back. <laughs> All right. I can show this. You show the address. I'm gonna be low. <laughs> <laughs> oh! oh my God, if you step back too far, a car's gonna kill you. Oh my God. <laughs> yes, yes. There could be a serial killer in front of me and I wouldn't know. <laughs> oh my God, are they broken? Please don't tell me they're broken. Oh! No. Can you help me? <laughs> we have many, 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 many healthy snacks. We have uh, cheddar rockets. Ooh, my favorite. This is yours. We're gonna have to separate what's yours and mine because you're gonna have to take it home because we're not gonna be together. Oh, okay. That's my breakfast. This is mine. You can just see based on your snacks and my snacks why you're emotionally stable and I'm not. Here's your banana. Woo! And your protein bars. Mm. And your queso. Ooh. We got a chicken salad. And we got extra Woo! And What you're gonna witness now is me being alone for a full night in the dark in the office that is has weirdly an odd amount of levels to it, which makes it even more horrifying. But okay, you can just watch that. The time is 7:40. Not gonna lie, since Ron dropped me off, I haven't been here. I took a break, you know, just for your night of savage solo demon dissembling. I had to, whoa, that was crazy. That might be the most intellectual thing I've ever said. Cold brew. A normal place has one set of stairs, maybe two if they're like connecting. This place has four. So first things first, now that it's night, I need to um, turn on all the lights that will stay on. And secondly, I need to um, make sure there's no murderers ready, readily available. I like to think that for the trip I thought of everything, but knowing me, that's not true, so... You know, just your typical girl falling into the darkness. Oh my god, that room is so dark. Okay, I'm scared. I'm scared. I don't really think my tact is useful, because if there's a murder, they'll hear me saying that I'm scared, and then it'll be ten times worse. Okay. My heart. Oh god, please tell me that this light works. Okay. The light has to work, right? Like it has to. Uh, hmm. There's nothing <gasps> Oh my God, that's me. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I don't mess with that. Uh. Hey, what's up you guys? Okay, I'm okay. My limp plumper is on the floor, but I'm okay. Tell me that this doesn't look like a horror film where I am the one that got sent here to die. Okay, you know, just another dark, dark abyss. God, it's me and Ryland. That's great. Whoa. Oh yeah, bright as can be, baby. Okay, so far so good. I checked every single room, <laughs> every. What the frick was that? Uh, oh, shit. <laughs> Let me show you what I brought for my one night here. My comfort hoodie. First I brought my robe that 
explains to the demons that I am a busy woman and I cannot be bothered. Lint roller. Andrew and Garrett got me this lint roller actually and it's one of the nicest gifts that I've ever got because demons, do they like lint? Probably not. Oh my god! Just picture. Demon. You're laying in bed, right? Just, just in case because I feel like if someone walked in and saw me they'd be like, oh, she's harmless. Dug the pugs. Sleeping away. Or something walk in and you go, whoopash! You would literally catch a demon on your lint roller and I have had too much cold brew. Okay, I'm sorry. Okay. I brought an extra pair of black joggers just in case a demon comes and I pee myself because I get scared. I pod, I'm a professional vlogger, I don't know if you know. All my makeup, demons. A little Victoria's Secret bombshell. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, these are crazy. When you read something online or see something on like one of your boyfriend's Twitter, I don't know, like it's just something that makes you feel a little, you know. Unfazed. Just in case any weed whacker comes whacking through my windows. Ah, oh, why can't I find the off button? I'm gonna set up my air mattress in here just because if I move here, this would be my bedroom, I guess. I get the full vibe. You didn't see me coming this way. Jesus. on an air mattress and I made a whole video about it and then everyone told me that I was a disgusting failure. Oh. <laughs> Built character, you know? Okay, just for everyone who thinks that I'm an actual idiot, look at this. I made a whole bedroom situation. To be honest, what I don't like is the thought of these two chairs over here and waking up in the middle of the night and seeing two little demons sitting over there, but see, I brought my beats so I can listen to music so I can't hear anything else, so I don't know if I'm screaming or not. You know, like just so they all have a spot. We have Cynthia. This is Cynthia. Have some cold brew. <laughs> hey, Cynthia, hope your mental health's better. We have Jaboy. Oh! <laughs> you know, he's just Jaboyin. Someone's missing. Who is responsible for putting Claire in the fridge? I, sweet and innocent Claire. Claire, what is that? Claire? <laughs> Wait, who got her down from the top of the fridge? Andrew, was that you? It's always the people with perfectly good hearts, you know? You can't decide if this was a Garrett move or if this was an Andrew move. <laughs> oh my god, it's literally all molded into- Oh my god, it smells so bad. Ew, ew, ew. Jesus, if you can hear me, it's Morgan, and this time it's serious. Please, stop! Oh my god, oh my god, that's my hand. It's my hand. It's just my hand. I'm just... Uh, whoever owns this, I'm sorry, I dismantled it. Since it's 2 a.m., I'm starting to ponder in the idea of possibly going to bed soon. But in order to do that, I'm gonna have to go make sure every room is clear and every door is locked. I've been hiding in this room with the door locked because I'm afraid. I don't want demons to come for me, so, so now I have to venture out of my comfort zone and go back down the stairs. Do you understand the severity of the situation that I just found? Good night. This might sound crazy, but since I'm sleeping on the top floor, I decided I would count the amount of steps that there are. So if I hear someone walking up the stairs, I can count how many seconds I have until four, five, six, seven, 19, 18, 19, 31. I lost count. 33, 34, 30. Okay, so if there's around 43 stairs, that means 
Give him like a second per stare. No, murderers are quicker than that. Half second per stare. I say if someone really wants it, it's gonna take approximately 21 seconds to get to me. I have 21 seconds to figure something out. If I die, Rylan, you can have my Gucci glasses. It is pretty crazy. It is the next day, so, so honestly, I survived. <laughs> I know I can survive here. I should move in, you know, right? Probably will move in here just because, you know, it makes sense. It's fun for me to process the tragedy of trying to get my life together and trying to live by myself because everyone knows everything I do ends up in a tragedy always. So it'll be great for you guys to watch. <laughs> so anyway, if you're still here, I hope all your dreams come true today. I hope everything good happens to you. I hope the boy that you like texts you back.